Hi everyone, it's Cheryl. Um, I thought I'd just check in with you guys because I just saw today I was looking and I haven't done a video for six days. Wow. And of course, Crafting Kitty is here and Crafting Kitty is on my not so good list right now because I already have the world's messiest craft room that I really need to get cleaned up. And Crafting Kitty dumped a thing that was full of buttons and other stuff. Yeah, so Crafting Kitty is not real high on my list. So I thought I would share a small haul. It's kind of big. Um, yeah, I went shopping yesterday, which I didn't need to do, but I did have to go get something. I have got myself into a ton of ATC swaps, which is going to be really, really fun. Um, I'm right now doing a tip ticket. Bleh. All right, I can't talk either. I am right now doing a ticket swap on International Crafters, so I'm trying to get that finished up so I can get it mailed out tomorrow because it's got to go to Canada. Um, yeah, about the ATC swaps. Um, yeah, I'm like overwhelmed. Like, I just put it out there on Facebook. Anybody want to do an ATC swap with me? And wow, did I get the response. So I've got stuff to do for quite a while. Unfortunately, I probably won't be showing most of mine here because I kind of want the people that go going to to be surprised when they get them. So, uh, yeah. Uh, and then I did forget one other thing I wanted to show you. So I am going to shut the camera off and I will be back in a sec. I'm back. It was in here buried under all the rubble. Um, so, yeah. Uh, before we go too far, uh, Joanne's is having a great sale. Um, I went in there today and I picked up some uh, Prima paper, a couple pads, because I have some, but I'm trying to do a mini album, so I wanted more. Uh, and I picked up some Graphic 45. Uh, these are online, and they have the Graphic 45 in there. I picked up the Couture Collection, uh, the 8x8, and the 5 or the 6x6, I think it is. I'm not sure. Uh, I think so. Uh, yeah, I picked those up. I think the 8x8 was like $5.99, and the uh, other one was like $3.70 something. And they didn't have the 12x12, 12 12, but I picked those two up because I thought it was really cool. And they've got a few other ones too. So, you know, if you're looking for a good bargain on paper right now, they've got theirs on sale, and there's some pretty cool stuff. Uh, Hobby Lobby also is having a great sale. Um, so I'm just going to jump in. Uh, I picked up. Corrugated paper pad, which is really cool, cause it, and they've got some with printed corrugated stuff too, but I just want a plain this time around. Maybe next time I'll grab some of the other, and I know, I know, I know, I'm the one who says, yeah, guess what, I'm not buying anything anymore. Well, a sale is a sale. I got these for like $2.99 a piece right now. Crafting kitty, go pick up your mess. I'm not happy with you. So yeah, and then I got the burlap stack. All kinds of neat, cool burlap, or designs on burlap. And I also picked up the cork stack, which I thought was just really neat. I can't believe they can get this cork so thin. That is just awesome. Anyway, yeah, I think I paid like two ninety nine a piece for those, so that is an awesome buy. Alrighty. Um, I'm not going to go in order of where I got stuff because everything's kind of piled up here all over. Um, not, not this time, but the last time I was out. Um, Tuesday morning, I got this Tim Holtz die for $4.99. Oh, you can't see it. Well, anyway, it's a knife, fork, spoon, and then a place card. I'm not too crazy about the place card, but the knife, fork, and spoon are really cool. Um, and then I was, let's see. Oh, well, it's, I can't even pull this stuff out of here because this is just crazy, all the junk I've got. Tuesday morning, um, 99 cents. I got these cool oriental stickers. Crafting Kitty, you are like the least cool thing in the world right now. Yeah. And then I got these Mexico ones also because I want to try to do some like travel junk journals and some travel uh, mini albums. That's in the works and the plans. Um, I hate to do anything like that though on here because the videos take so long to do the process videos on those. Uh, let's see. Also, Tuesday morning, I keep telling you guys I'm going to get this 50s mini album made and I keep collecting stuff for it so that when I go to do it, I'm just going to have everything. <laughs> How cute are these? Look at these. Are those not adorable? I saw those. I was like, oh, gotta have it. Dollar forty nine, but totally worth it because they're all raised, you know, already and stuff. So you don't have to put them on with pop dots. Okay, Hobby Lobby was having a massive sale on spare parts stuff. So I got these guys. Look at these guys. Aren't they cute? They're gonna be awesome on some ATCs. I can tell you that. And maybe a mini album or two. I don't know. I finally, finally, finally bought some swivel clasps. Yeah, I'm a little behind. Um, I bought 
I was buying metal embellishments and charms because I just don't have a lot of them. So, yeah, I had to buy some. So I bought this one. thought those were pretty cool. And then I bought some C ones. So, yeah, that was that was cool. That was Hobby Lobby. Um, also at Hobby Lobby, I got this little guy. I think he was on half off. It's a little Chinese dragon guy. I've got, the, I've got um, DCWP's Far East stack, and I'm going to be doing a mini album in a book-shaped box with that. So that's another one that's in the works. And then I got these little guys. They're just tiny, tiny little butterflies. Really cute. Um, I got these. I opened the package, so I'll have to just show them to you. My fingers are a mess, people. I'm sorry. I've got ink all over my fingers and under my fingernails. I'm sorry. I've been working on those tickets. And the first set of them I did, I was doing steampunk, because she likes steampunk. And I was liking them, and then, yeah, everything, I had ended up having to throw them out, so I got to do some more of those. So I'm going to be up doing tickets tonight, but I got these cute little playing cards. And they're the traditions also, and I think traditions, all the tradition stuff is 50% off right now. Um, there, I think that's what I paid for it. I bought some little wooden gears too, but I, oh wait, here they are. And these are the same brand. You get a little bag, I don't know how many is in there, six, seven of them, I think. Really cute. And they'll, they're going to go on my, some of my tickets, I think. Okay, um, also, I picked up some more of these. The little, they're little, they're buttons, but I'm going to cut the backs off so I can use them on ATCs and stuff. And they're like uh, little teapots and a tea ball, and a, you get some tea bags. They're Took me a little while to figure out what they were, so they don't look much like tea bags and a honey jar. So yeah, I thought those would be really cute for ATCs and stuff. Crafting kitty, I'm not happy with you. Okay, and I don't know where I got these. Oh, I think I got these on Tuesday morning too. I think um, there should be two of them. The unopened one should be another unopened one here. This one I've opened. These were from Tuesday morning, um, and this is chipboard. And you get two pieces in there with the Oriental theme. So that was kind of cool. I needed something Oriental theme for something I was working on, and I couldn't, didn't have anything. And that's part of why I went shopping yesterday. And I walk into Tuesday morning, and guess what they have? So, yeah. Um, anyway, I've got another. Maybe I don't have another one of those. Anyway, and then I got this one. This one's really cool because this has places all over. I've already obviously used a Japan one. But there's Egypt and London. It's got the double decker bus on it. That's so cool. I love those things, Gareth. Oh, you lucky people, um, Spain, and yeah, so it's just all kinds of really cool travel stickers, and they're also popped up, so that's cool. Dollar General, I don't remember, I don't even remember if I showed you guys these, so if I did, just, you know, go, eh, Cheryl's lost it again. Um, but anyway, I got these at Dollar General, or Dollar Tree, excuse me, Dollar Tree, Dollar General's a ripoff, at least the one here is. Yeah, I got these. They're all stickers. I think they are so cool. There's these. They're really neat. They've got some nice little sentiments on them. You're not part of that. Get out of here. Crafting Kitty. There's some more that I picked up. And I'm looking to do these on ATCs, mini albums, you know, whatever. Because these are really neat. Maybe some cards with some of them. And then I picked up these, which is just sunflowers. So, yeah, those are really, really neat, too. Um... Another Tuesday morning one because I've got some Bow Bunny Key Lime paper that I'm going to be doing a tropical kind of travel mini album with. Believe me, I'm not going anywhere, but yeah, I'm doing the albums. Uh, <laughs> I don't remember if I showed you guys my... my I, I don't remember if I showed you guys my Hobby Lobby uh, Valentine's stuff I got. But I bought it, picked up some cork X's and O's and hearts and I love you's and... Some of these little sparkly uh, cupid guys. A little package of these really sweet little tiny red roses. That's going to be good to use. So yeah, it's stuff to do for next year. Of course, as slow as it's going and the way things are going, maybe I should start now, huh? Maybe I get Valentine's done for next year if I start right now. And then uh, Joanne's also had Tim Holtz on sale, so I picked up some little gears. And I picked up some of the bigger gears because... Trying to find old wristwatches anymore to rip the gears out of because they're small is getting to be kind of hard. I've got some and I'm kind of hoarding them. I don't know why, but I am because they're really tiny. They came out of wristwatch. And these little tags. And I probably already showed you guys those, so I don't know. 
Oh, and then I picked up this Tim Holtz ephemera. It's got some really, really cool stuff in here. So, yeah. It's the, um... Uh, it's Tim Holtz Ideology. It just says ephemera pack, so I guess there's not a name to it. All right. Um, oh, and one more thing. Something really handy, okay? It's just kind of a handy little tip. My brother gave me this idea. A lot of times we work with metal things, and sometimes they're magnetic. You know, some some of it isn't. I know that. But for the stuff that is, how, how about one of these? You see that magnet? That is a magnet, okay? And what they are is you get them, like, at your automotive places, and they're just little parts holders. They're magnetic parts trays. They work super well for anything you've got that you're working with that's metal, that's magnetic, and... I don't know, I drop a lot of my little metal embellishments and end up having to dig around on the floor for them, but yeah, this is a super strong magnet. So yeah, just an idea for those of you who do a lot of stuff with metal. I think I paid 2 or $4 for this one. It's not very big, but it'll work for what I need it for. Okay, and the last thing is I have managed to get two pages done in my Journaling by Fives journal. So... I will show them to you, although the first page is not what I wanted. It didn't turn out anything like I even thought it was going to. I'm not real pleased with it, but it is what it is, like I always say. So I will show it to you. It did not turn out right, but this is the page. Let me back out a little bit. I don't want you to see too much of my mess because, like, yeah, I've got a mess everywhere. And Crafting Kitty's not helping. But, yeah, that's just the first page. And then I, I did get a second page done, and in this one, I, I kind of like this one a lot better. Um, I goofed up a little bit on it, but hey, it's, you know, it's what it is, too. Um, so anyway, what I did with this one is I made it into like a window with some little plants in it. So that's that page. Thank you, Crafting Kitty. Beat your behind. Yeah, anyway, ah, I'm not even getting it all the way down here. I've got so much junk. But anyway, yeah, so those are the first two pages in this, um, and that is all I've got done, because page number three is presenting quite a problem for me, so I'm not sure how that's going to go. Um, I'll figure it out. I will. Um, anyway, that's about it. I think I'm going through, like, a crafting slump, because I'm, like, sitting here trying to figure out what to do for my next video, and you know what? I don't even have any idea. I know that Crafting Kitty is now sitting on my shoulders, beating me in the nose with her tail. Since Crafting Kitty is not my favorite person right now, she needs to get down. Say goodbye to everybody. Yeah, say goodbye, because you're out of here. And I'm going to say goodbye, and thanks for sitting here with me, looking at me, buying all the junk I didn't need. But you know what? I did not spend very much on this stuff, so I know. It's no excuse, but yeah, it's time to stop buying and start crafting a lot. So hopefully that's what I'm going to be doing. Um, anyway, thank you all so much for spending a little time here with me. Promise the next video I come back with is going to be something craft related. Actually crafting, I promise. So until then, um, I hope you all have a good evening. Bye-bye.